All right. Welcome to today's stream. Doing it a bit earlier. Just like yesterday. It's just better to have some more time. And uh, I want to go early to bed today. Anyway, today we're doing day 13 of Advent of Code. We did day 12 yesterday. It took us like four and a half hours. Um, but we finally did it. We were, we had the right idea for a while, but we just needed to memoize. Um, and after we got it memoized, it all worked out. Anyway, let me know uh, how the audio is. Because that's kind of the biggest thing that I can't see. I, I added some compression now. Um, maybe it works out. Anyway, let's see. Day 13 has... Let's look at the stats first. Uh, so it seems easier part 2 at least than part 12. Like there's a less of a ratio there. That's that's good. That's promising. We're Lava Island. This one is for the outside Icelanders there. Hey little Lenny. Happy Lucia. In Sweden. Um, let's see. I don't see any lava, a lot of ash. Full of mirrors. Okay. Some of them have fallen. Mirrors are flat and shiny. They are... As you note down the patterns of ash and rocks, you should see it as you walk. Um... Perhaps by carefully analyzing pad piece patterns, you can figure out where the mirrors are. Let's copy the example. Uh, the input is kind of the same format as yesterday. So, I'm going to go ahead and copy paste this entry function. We don't need split on. Let's just copy paste all of it. Ding, do, 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 do. Oh, day of Gilligur. Yes, indeed. Gilligur is another Icelandic Santa Claus. Let me see. Map to entry. Wow. But we. Uh, you want to split on. Let me see. So we take in. I guess we return a list of list of entries. We take in a list of strings, so the whole thing. And we do. Map parse row. Uh, on split on Pars row Um, let's see. We wanted to do a list, a list of entries. So split on. So pars row should take in um, uh, we have to map map pars row. Pars row takes in a string, returns a list of entries. Okay. So split on. So this will take a list of strings and return a list of list of strings. Ah, uh, okay. 
if you want a map mm -hmm. let's first just see what we're getting something mixed up here okay split on empty string let's just see what this does for the example do read file example print dot parse example dot nights and we're not gonna parse a row yet gz on day 13 and day 13 dot hs and time day 13 so today is lucia which is like a swedish celebration of light um and it is quite nice so, okay let's see pars row map mm. so it's gonna take a uh, one string Map to entry. Where um, to entry? Okay, so maybe this is list of list of entries. Map parse. So now we get a list of lists of entries. Yes. Okay. Perfect. Okay, we parse the example. <laughs> to find the reflection in each pattern, you need to find a perfect reflection across either a horizontal line between two rows or across a vertical line between two columns. Okay, let me see. In the first pattern, uh -huh. in the first pattern, the vertical affections across the vertical line between the two columns. Yeah, okay. In this pattern, the line of reflection is the vertical line between columns five and six. Um, because the vertical line is not perfectly in the middle of the pattern, part of the pattern, column one, has nowhere to reflect onto and can't be ignored. A rail column has reflect on within the pattern must match exactly. Column two matches column nine, column three matches eight, four matches seven, and five matches six. Okay. The second pattern reflects across a horizontal line instead. Okay, yes. Uh, between rows four and five. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, uh, what do you get after summarizing all of your notes? Okay, let's just say, let's just write the function that finds that, <coughs> that reflection. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna so for let me let me ch let's check the input. So I want to see right. So none of these is extremely long in the column sense. So essentially, what we want to do is if we 
we want to see, say, um, for, for each line, where, where are the possible reflections? Right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let's see. Reflection. Mm. It would be very good if I could actually look look at something from both the front and the back easily. And to do that, we use something called a data dot sequence, um, which is this thing called a finger tree. Basically, that list lets you. It's a, just a list uh, that lets you, um, it's a little bit more expensive to maintain, but it lets you access the front and the end at the same time. Let's see. Um, so we're not going to have, we're going to have a seek of entry. Where, um, let me just put the language in here. GHC 2021 best language EU import data dot sequence seek import qualified data dot sequence seek. okay and uh, so here we're gonna return seek entries and we're just gonna do uh, Seek dot from list. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now we have sequences. Now I'm going to say, um, from for reflections takes in a sequence of entries and returns a um, a set uh, data dot int set int set and we're just going to return the set of possible uh, reflections Input qualified data dot set as um, is reflections uh, okay. So I'm going to split it. So, so also this has a lot faster split at, which is good. Okay. Um, Let's see, uh, seek equals. Okay, um, um, map flip split at uh, seek dot split at uh, seek a zero to Seek not ling the links seek let's just print the splits ding, 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 ding. 
Okay, um... So this is a list of list of secret entries. Okay, so now let's take the uh, head dot head. Okay, we're not gonna map them. It. There's gonna be a secret entries. Just just while we hack away. Okay. And now we're just gonna say reflections. Ding, 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 ding. Um, it could always be if ref reflected entirely on the zero axis. So we're going to reject that. Um, and we're also going to reject the one that reflects entirely around the other end. Okay, so here we have all the splits. <laughs> In the first pattern, the reflections across the vertical limit to the arrows. <laughs> okay, I think maybe we are doing overkill with the sequences, but uh, let me see. So our reflection split. Okay, is raffle is equal to? So we have a split here. ABS is equal to. Um, If take length a seek dot length a uh, if take is equal to This is actually A is equal to seek dot take seek dot seek dot length A um, Yes. She mm. got reverse. I think it's like that. Let me see. Um, uh, no, it's actually the opposite. So we actually want to. We want to re we want to we want to reverse a okay let me see um, seek dot reverse dollar seek dot take uh, seek dot length bs out of a is equal to <laughs> map is raffle splits False, 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 false. That didn't work.
Right, because we want to actually reverse A first. Mm hmm. False, false, false. True. False, true, false. Let's see. Um, filter. <coughs> seek dot. Filter is ruffle. Uh, splits. Okay. So, okay, and then I think the answer here is just um, arrows. To so summarize, pattern, add up the number of columns up to the left of each vertical lift for the line of reflection. To that, also add 100 multiplied by the number of rows above each horizontal line of reflection. Okay. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And so we're going to just say map seek dot length dot first. And we are gonna make this into an inset. Seek dot uh, no is dot from ask list. <laughs> so now we're gonna drop the head here. We're gonna map reflections over the first list from list five seven from list five from list five okay and then we're gonna take the um we're actually gonna take just let's do it like this six okay reflections uh, seek so we're going to take um, the intersection of all of these. Seek dot inter set dot intersections. Um, is dot intersections. Mm -hmm. Let me see fall L one set that into I fold R one. Is dot intersection fold R one fold R one okay let's see part one takes a seek of entry. Um, so we want to do this, but we also want to do we also want to do the transposition. Um, so what I'm gonna do is actually I'm just gonna make this a list. Okay, and then this is going to be seek um, 
but we are gonna say uh, ally ally is seek is equal to seek seek dot from list ally okay and this is still So this is LIS, and we are going to say fold r1 dot uh, is dot intersection of uh, one raffle is equal to this i asked from um where okay so one raffle is basically what the previous one did and folder dot map uh, one seek dot from list dot uh, and then so one raffle dot seek dot from list So let's see here. Uh, <coughs> reflections. Right. And it's because I am still doing secret from list here, which I don't need to do now. This should not, this should be just, this should actually just be like this. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, see and so let's just make it into a number so park one takes a list of list of entries to an int so part one is equal to okay a get the element out of the set mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. okay I just do LMs <coughs> part one uh, case um, is dot LMs so we have E reflection of E um, of 
So if we have something, just one eye, then it's a vertical uh, reflection, which is great. And then we do, we just return I. Uh, otherwise, we return uh, case is not elements of uh, reflections of transpose E, right? So then we're doing the horizontal one, I think, um, of J to G. Otherwise, error, no ruffle. Doom, 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 doom. This is from data.list. So here I want to say not map reflections, but map part one to five at four. So J times 100. And then we take the uh, sum four hundred and five. Not bad. And what do we get for the input? Did I, I haven't pasted in the input yet? Let's see. <laughs> There are no ruffle. <laughs> Let's see. see x is let's just say error show x i just want to see if we got multiple oh, we didn't get any reflection of the transpose uh let's just see This is kind of funny. Okay, so it works for both the examples. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm, let me see. Is it literally the first one that crashes? Okay, the first one crashes. You see. Let's show uh, X is and Y's. Mm -mm -mm. show ID uh, 
Prom list. Uh, prom list five seven five 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 seven, and then seven seven. Eight seven 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 eight seven. Ah, okay, yeah. So then four six four four. Okay. From so eight twelve eight twelve eight twelve eight twelve eight eleven eight twelve eight twelve. From list empty. <laughs> it's saying that this one cannot be reflected. Yo, hey Matt Flash, how are you today? Yeah, I can be your Haskell guru. What is your problem? Ah, but it is reflected here, right? Eight, and then this one. Ding, 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 ding. So we got this one, we got this one. We got this one, and this one should be reflected, right? <laughs> Is the transpose going wrong? Let me... Oh, okay. Let me see. Um... Uh, I don't think I should transpose the whole thing. I think the transpose messes it up. Um... What I think I should do is I can... I, I don't have to transpose it. I can just... Uh, I can just... Um, If I don't do it with, so let me see. Um, I think what I can do is just treat it as like all the lines and then just reflections of E. Uh, reflections. So I want this to be uh, reflections. Uh, so EQA list of anything that can be equal to a list of int sets. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's how it was in the beginning, right? Map one raffle. Um, this should really return inset. And a folder one. I guess that intersection. One ruffle here. And um, 
Thoughts on Christmas music for background. I like this Christmas. It's like lo-fi Christmas. Which I... I like it. Hey. It's very, you know, soothing. It's... Um, It's nice programming music, right? It's not like grabbing your attention. Usually I listen to more techno, harder stuff, but this is kind of nice for uh, the chill vibe, you know? <clears throat> so what I want here is I want... Um, I think we should take this out. Um, from here. Okay, and... Um, so, exactly. So, so we're going to see... So we're just going to operate directly, right? We're going to say uh, one raffle. Um, case is dot lms. Uh, one raffle. Um, dollar. Hmm. Seek dot from list E. Then it's right times a hundred, otherwise so that none of this transposition business for we'll just check first if there is a if there is a uh, vertical horizontal reflection. Uh, otherwise Okay, that worked for, um... It still works for the example. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But it's not working for the other one, um... Okay, um, it's always annoying when it works for the example, but not the input. And you have to kind of do this uh, dance. Okay, let's see. Um, let's just print the example that we are. This is the first one. And we want there should be a reflection here. And let's see. Um, uh, seek dot from list. Okay, and then one raffle. And it's not doing that, let me see.
We're just commenting everything out. Uh, now I want to see the splits here. One raffle. Um... Okay, so if we take the first line and then we match it up. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's confusing that it actually, that it works for... Um, It's confusing that it works for... So where should the split be? Okay, it should be when we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 5 here. Okay, so that's... Um, so here we have 1, here we have 1, 2... Um, one, two, okay, and then here we have one, two, three, and here we have one, two, no. Yeah, so one, two, three, four. So it's in this case. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so... Um, Just to trace, show ID. And uh, okay, and it's not filtering the Israel. Let me see. Where's my distro? My distro is uh, Windows 11, but I am running this on a Ubuntu 20 server in the cloud. Plenty of memory and it makes it easy to just, I just SSH into it and then, you know, I can use the GPU and game and whatever on my laptop. I used to have a desktop, so it made more sense back then. But that one died. Um, ding, 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 ding. <coughs> Let's see. Because it, it's working for, um, it's working for the example. 
So what goes wrong here? Let's see, a uh, trace show PS. Yes. We're just importing debug.trace at this point. Uh, let me see. And uh, uh, we're just going to name this something else. Um, where ref a is equal to this part <laughs> now let me see <laughs> Trace show uh, ref A ref A or no, this is ref A. Let's call it that. Ref A ref A uh, ref A equal to trace show BS A comma ps Okay, what is going on here? So, this one shouldn't work. But we're talking about the one with five in it. One, two, three, four. Okay, so it's this one that should work. Mm hmm. Okay, so the last two are the same. These two are the same. Ah, this one and this one are not the same. Ah, okay, so they aren't the same. So where is the reflection here? Maybe it's a... Uh, Maybe it goes the other way. No, wait. Yeah, I think the reflection should be down here, right? Okay, so it's a vertical reflection that we're missing. Okay. <coughs> do, 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 do. Mm -hmm. Is it going to be a mess? Let me see. I think it might be just because we have a I think it's because we don't, uh, we should take 
we should take it both ways, okay? So let's see. Ref B is equal to seek dot take seek dot length A. Yes, dollar seek dot reverse BS. Ref A equals BS or ref B is equal to AS. What does it say now? Mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay. Still works for the example. Let's see. Definitely copied it correctly. Let's see. Let's see. Where where uh is equals this where t equals hmm Case is the LMs of Horus, and here I want to print out uh, her show Horus Rocky. see okay Okay, so this one also allows for the other one. Um, but this one, yeah, it's not correct. This one always gives an answer, right? <laughs> so what is the reflection here?
if I put that hashtag there, I do get 800 for this one. Uh, but there is no hashtag there. Okay, let's see. Um, is it reflecting across this one? No, so there's a mismatch here and here, so it's not that one. This pattern line reflection for the glider clouds. I'm six. Okay, then it's just. It must be this zero, right? Otherwise, it's just zero. Because then we have to reflect. We can reflect across that axis. I think that has to be the case, right? If there is no reflection, then it has to be the case that we are reflecting across the whole thing. I don't think that that doesn't feel good as a solution, but let's see. If that is the case, answer is too low. Yeah, because we're missing some of them. To summarize your pattern notes, add up the number of columns to the left of each vertical line of reflection. Uh huh. Let me see. Right. It's gonna be. Let me see. I think, I think it's just then gonna be um, some map times a hundred uh, hours. Some plus some 
map a sum of thirty. So I think it might be this, right? It would just uh, because sometimes we might have two lines. Sometimes we have zero lines. And then maybe that works. Still doesn't work. It's easy walk. Mirrors are okay. I cross either a horizontal line between two rows or I cross a vertical line between two columns. Input See this one doesn't match right because there's was one extra one here. There are zero in this first one, right? Uh, let me see. Maybe, maybe lines can go through. Um, let's see. Hmm. Maybe they can like go through a specific line, right? So if it's so, these are both even number, but maybe maybe we can like reflect across a certain line. Let me see. Uh, print a map. E, uh, length E, length and E. <coughs> okay, so these are all, uh, these are not. Uh, but these are also odd numbered. So they all have odd numbers here. That's not the problem. I 
I'm finding it hard to figure out what to do if there is no reflection. Let's see. So can I reflect between these two columns? No, because of this one and this one, they don't match. Also can't do it at the ends. There is no reflection here in this first one. Is my input just uh, fucked? No. Okay, here these two you could maybe. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Does this one work? Okay, so these two reflect. And these two reflect. And these two reflect. These two reflect. And these two reflect. These two reflect. And these to reflect. Okay, so this one, there is some bug here. At least because for the second one, it should not be giving, it should be giving a vertical reflection. Same here, actually. There is a vertical reflection right here. So it's just messing up some of the one of the reflections. Okay. Okay, that's not the input that is fucked. It's something wrong here. Okay, so let's just. Um, Let's just do the reflections of the first one. Um, head. Reflections. Okay, and... Let's do um, map map one raffle dots seek dot from list. Mm -hmm. 
So I, we want to see um, So the first one and this so the second one and dot second. Mm -hmm. So we should see this one as in this first list. Let's see. So we have this uh, Is ruffle okay? Let's just see. Map is ruffle splits uh, splits. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, because it is. Um, I think it's because it's reversing. <clears throat> okay. I think we got it. Um, so here we want to um, We want to take the. Uh, okay, we want to take. Okay, I just messed up this. We want to uh, say, seek. Let's just do it like this. We want to do cq dot take. Seek dot length. As of. Yes. Mm. Ref B, and then you want to CQ dot reverse that. Okay, and then we should get that AS is equal to Ref B. I think it was like that. I think I just messed it up when I copy pasted something. Okay, so this is the splits. Uh, let me see. Okay, then this one seems to be okay. Now let's uh, okay, but that doesn't work on the example for some reason. Okay, let's see. 
Okay, so <clears throat> it's either like this, I think. Maybe we just have to do ref A here also. Ref A. Yes. Yes. Or. So I think we need to do a combination of these. Okay. Let's just uh, save this one. And then we undo everything. Mm -hmm. and let's grab this one as well. Let me redo everything. Okay, so um, ref B. So this is the first case, and then um, we have the other case, like from the other direction, I think. Ref B uh, or ref A is equal to BS. Okay, this one seems to work. <laughs> Let's see if this gives us the answer for uh, The input as well. Okay. All right, we did part one. Good. Took us a bit longer than we wanted, but we were quite close. We're just doing. Uh, oh. We're just doing it not quite accurately. Okay. Get a day one thirteen. HS input for example. Git commit M thirteen part one. Okay, let's see what part two is about. Upon inspection, you discover that every mirror is exactly one smudge. One dot over one slash. In each pattern, you'll need to locate and fix as much that causes a different reflection line to be valid. The first pattern smudge is in the top left corner. If the top left were instead dot, it would have a different horizontal line of reflection. With this much in the top left corner repaired, a new horizontal line of reflection. Now, if Chevin has no corresponding to the rock, we not. Like the fifth symbol on row two from dot to slash. Summarize notes before, but instead use the new different reflection lines. Okay. Mm 
Now let's uh, let's write this again. <laughs> so this is for the example. Um, Uh, in this, the first pattern is new horizontal line has three rows above it. Uh, so they begin to make a horizontal line, right? Dum, 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 de, dum. Let me see, what does it say for reflections? For the horizontal ones, it's actually one raffle dot seek from list. Then it's just going to be empty, right? Yeah. Sir, then. Okay, um, now right um now we're gonna map get splits here for the horizontal one and then this example here and they're saying if I <coughs> if we so we have the horizontal one here what do we have to change uh, okay mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. If the top left one says dot, oh, 
exactly one dot or star hashtag should be the opposite type. I mean, there's a naive way that kind of just changes um, changes every element and then just runs the whole thing. But it would be nice if we had some faster way to do it. Horizontal, so you need a new line. Uh, let me see. Okay, fix as much it causes a different reflection line to be valid. do we want to do this? We really want to see if um, if changing one smudge would make it have a reflection line, right? See, so splits is like this, is ruffle. Okay. Um, let's see. Splits a equals partition um, is revel splits Thank you. 
Mm, it's right here, actually. Uh, ref, non ref. Okay, um, This map again. Is raffle ASBS? Let me see. Um, so it's going to be a sequence of A and sequence of BS. Um, let's count how many are different, okay? I want to see um, is there something called um, seek dot zip? Uh, let me see. Let's see. Um, <coughs> AS ref B equals seek dot zip. AS ref B. Uh, and then ref BS ref A equals seek dot zip. A BS ref A. Okay, and now I want to see how many of these are not equal. Uh, seek dot filter. Um, Okay, let's do the same for the other one. So then we do say if A is ref B is equal to zero or B S ref A is equal to zero. Let's copy this here, um, just to see what we get for, just to make sure that we're still doing the right thing. Uh, 
Okay, we're not getting the same thing. Seven seven. AS equals ref B or ref A equals BS. thought that if I take the sequence um, let's see press equals this Ref B. Um, now I want to do trace show. Um, if res, then Ratio ASREF ASREF B comma AS BSREF A else false. Ratio true. Hmm. Seems like this one is always zero. Ref A equals B S. No, that was not the case. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Let's see, res one, res two. If uh, res one. Res two group. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this one works. Now we're trying to figure out if 
if res1 and um, as ref b not equal to zero then res show Res one as ref b true. Miles if res two and b as ref a not equal to zero. Then trace show res two comma b as ref a true else false. So res1 is <coughs> that as uh, okay because I sip them together and um, and then I only check like the prefix right I think that's the problem here still like this if res1 or res2 then trace show res1 as ref b res2 b as ref a um, res1 or res2 <laughs> right, so I think the problem is when mm, let's see, uh, links uh, AS. Because sip just stops uh, 
printing with the sip might be zero, but um, otherwise might not be BS rep A. So then that's false, and then A is ref B. Okay, right, because I'm only... If I'm, I'm only taking the difference here. Okay. So we do need to... Uh, we do need to check it. See true. Otherwise, um, um, or a uh, BS ref A is equal to so there's only a difference of one here. Okay. So let me see. show ASBS uh, so here it's saying that if the so there's a difference of one Ali dude coming up. Whoop whoop. That's what I'm here for. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm. Let me see. What if I then do it just this way, okay? Um one raffle. Um, one refo prime is equal to AS ref B is equal to one or BS ref A is equal to one. I think this needs to be um, B 
basically <coughs> length as is equal to length ref b and the difference is one or um length bs is equal to length ref a and the difference is one let's see what they say here about We have to be careful that it has to be it has to be all the it has to be the it has to be the right index, right? Now we're gonna get like so in here the difference is just one Okay, saying we could uh, flip it on between three and four. Ah, uh, but this is the. Okay, so it does find the three here. But it seems to be finding more than just that. Not bad. Ah, good stuff. 
me save. Actually, just uh, let's just see if we can just get away with something super lazy. Uh, none of this one rifle business. Part one prime. Let's go back to the one it was. Uh, case verti. Of I to I times one hundred. Otherwise, a case or is of J to J. Otherwise, error. Now let's see what part one prime gives us. Yeah. Okay, so this one is fine. Okay, uh, part one prime. Let's see, because it, it's not taking very long, right? Um, let's see. Opposite. Uh, I have to go to dot. Opposite. Uh, dot equals hash. Equals dot. So uh, one change takes a list of entries and returns a list of list of entries. Okay, and then one change. Um, Let's just see. <laughs> One change, uh, empty is equal to empty. If we make one change in the empty list, we don't get any more. Now one change. Uh, X axis is equal to um, let's see, one change of I can't make a change here. No. One change here is going to be. Um, it's going to be a opposite x axis. Um, and uh, x. So that's going to be one list. And then it's going to be
things gonna be like this map uh, opposite x over um, so first is the one that's unchanged uh, sorry maybe it's not a great way to do this How many are in one of these? I feel like we're spending time on this, uh, but it's just going to be crazy slow. Um, let's actually do one change on list of list of entries. It's going to be a list of list of list of entries. Okay, and then we're gonna say one, so where uh, indices is equal to a comma b, um, so a b comma b over zero to one change is uh, at e uh, this comes here to length of e and it's the x coordinate and then we're gonna have zero to the length of e s which is equals indices and let's see what we get here if you do read file example into print dot one change dot head dot parse dot lines Mm -hmm. Okay, so this one is giving me all the indices. Now these are all linked lists, so it's not going to be. It's not going to be great performance on this um well let's see map change indices change indices mm -hmm. change um and then this is the Y coordinate and this is the no, this is the X coordinate and the Y coordinate. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. uh, yes, equals um, where a comma b is equal to split at. Okay, let me do X. BBS split at uh, Y is and then um, X um, Y Y 
this equals split uh, I don't know okay Let's see I and J and then split it at J and then this is split at I A B and then this is equal to uh, A concatenated with um, X uh, opposite Y Y's Let's see. Map M print. Making all these changes is not going to be fast. Print. Oh, okay, one change. Map change indices. Um, That you're not taking this I'm going to print the head of one change so we're taking the example and we make one change yeah okay then we change zero zero And I think it's actually not length E, but length E minus one. one okay now uh, part two of entry to int part two is a e so first we do where p1 equals part one prime um, so here we just say zero part one prime e and uh, <laughs> let's see now we're going to map uh, part part one prime over uh, one change um, of e Mm 
and I just want the head of this and filter not equal to P1. Let's see, yeah, this should work on the example, but um, might not work. So it's not equal to P1. And uh, x larger than zero and Let's pause for a minute and say, um, just print map part two, and let's just do uh, part one prime, one change e. Okay, so now I want actually, I want this to be a bit different. Um, I want the part one prime here to be the list of integers. Okay, so we're actually gonna have it be a list of int. So this is just gonna be a rarity with map 100 times uh, hearts. And then we're just gonna do concat map here. Mm -hmm. Concat map. Concat map part one. Concat map. Okay, and uh, we can just slap this in here. And we just uh, say um, x uh, not equal to not equal to p1. Ah. 
Paint dots um <coughs> Okay, that's not too bad. I'm sure it's gonna be hella slow for the input. Let's see. Ah! Took only one second. Oh. Alright! We did day 13! Whoop whoop! Would have been nicer to, uh... To figure out like a clever way, you know, with uh, instead of just making the changes and going for it. But you know, it's not too bad. Let's just make the opposite stay here. Yeah, but like you know, if it finishes in one second, that's fine. Okay, let's uh, erase this one ref prime. Yeah, we spent too much time on this. Um, we could have just at least tried the naive way right away and then seen what happens. But ah. It was good also to just see what was happening. Okay. Let's uh, commit this, git and day 13 20 chance. Git commit and day 13. Git push. All right. That's it for today. Uh, we didn't do any super crazy tricks like green theorem, green serum, whatever. But we got it done. And we got it done with under a second. And that's. Uh, that's all it takes thank you for tuning in and uh, see you tomorrow maybe uh, we might do a short stream tomorrow just uh, uh, yeah because I need to pack because I'm going away so tomorrow will be the last stream for a couple of days but otherwise thank you for tuning in and uh, yeah Enjoy.